who cares? Uh, can we do grand finals tomorrow? No. <laughs> Stay free. <laughs> Stay free. Rip SoCal? What does that mean? Isn't it gaming from SoCal? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's like if gaming just chooses a DQ or just dip. Oh. What's the what's the prize that you you gave me? Twenty dollars, baby. Winner take all. Oh, funny, haha. Good joke. Um. Yeah. The the prize is. Is it money or is it a gift card? It's money. Oh, okay. As much as I love Nintendo, thank God we don't just offer people a gift card. That would that would make people cry. I would cry. I don't know. Amazon gift card is pretty nice. <laughs> yeah, but you know what's really sad is if you don't have Prime, you still have to pay for that shipping. Yike. Yeah, that's what I'm telling you, man. And if you think about it, all Nintendo does is give you gift cards to the Nintendo eShop. That's it. I've never gotten a Nintendo gift card anything before. If you like win their like official Nintendo tournaments, they give you like twenty dollars in like eShop gold coins. Twenty dollars worth eShop gold coins. Sometimes ten. But you use the coin to buy games and stuff, right? Yes. In their eShop store. Only an eShop. That doesn't really sound like enough to get a game. <laughs> I mean... You get an indie game. Okay. My favorite. Or pay for like DLC or something. I think the most they've given you is like, you want to switch and like, ultimate. <laughs> that was it. Okay, just waiting for guts. Pick this stage and character. So this is the grand finals now. Rematch of uh, winners finals. I'm pretty sure Guts was able to reverse Brio. Let's see though. Let's see. Let's see if gaming has uh, the juice. He said he's getting too tired, so I wouldn't be surprised if he doesn't. But yeah. We'll see. It was really close in winners, so the, the threat of a reset is always there. Yeah. Especially since I feel like it's been a while since Guts played winners finals, whereas gamers had a few matches to get warmed up again. I definitely go to gaming high. It's a school night. I have homework, but I'm not gonna stay up all night doing it. I'm just gonna do it tomorrow morning. Oh, good nair to back air on the landing here. Really, really good to like call out gaming high for like his call out. But be careful. I he was trying to do the one where he lands on the ledge. That's the same thing measure, but that was rough. It's kind of hard to pull off consistently. I think Raven King does that really well. I haven't seen Raven King in a bit. Me either. Shout out to, shout out to all the Ikemings out there. It's kind of cool. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I don't like... Uh... I like the first version of Ikemings. This one, right? This one? This one is... Path of Radiance Psych? Yeah, that's the that's the first version we got. Yeah, I don't I don't like the buff like 
This is the bow fight. Are you talking about the Radiant Dawn one where he's like younger? I, I don't like the bow fight. Oh. I like the original, like. The non time skip one. But he's still. <laughs> even in this one. I think I said it before, but like, so this tag is good. It's like, why doesn't he play the, the black, like. Yeah, I, I'm surprised. But... Experience. I bet if his name is Guts and he's never watched or read Berserk, I'll be really sad. I feel like he has to, like, the parallels are just too strong. Yeah, to, they are. To know what that is. Uh oh. Uh oh. That's the stock. Yep. No, no. Oh, he he lived, he lived. It takes a lot of percent. Oh, never mind. Wait, no, he didn't die to that either. Dude, these kill screens are very, very mis. Uh. Deceiving. Oh my goodness. Watch the recovery. Another oh, that's... That, that, uh, oh. Yeah, at least he took a stock there. I, I guess. I guess it was not, worth it. Not worth it. Not worth it. Not worth it. Really. <laughs> Man, I really wanted to watch the Jamie Foxx movie after this tournament, but that's not going to happen now. <laughs> <laughs> I agree with you. I don't think I'll stay up for two and a half hours. No matter, not even for Jamie Foxx and Joseph Gordon Levitt. I was going to watch the season two premiere of The Boys and then maybe do my homework while watching it, but I'm like, it's too late and I'm exhausted. Yeah, season two was pretty good. I just don't know why that they make it only Friday that it, the new episode comes out when it's a streaming platform. Like, it's, it's I thought like, it was supposed to release all they're the... Trying to keep, yeah, they're trying to, like, Disney Plus is doing that with The Mandalorian. It's because they want to keep their subscription retention. That's why. Like, Netflix, Netflix, even though they have, like, the biggest platform in terms of streaming, their subscription retention is very, very poor. People will subscribe, and if they watch what they want to watch, they just leave, and then they'll subscribe again if they need to watch something. That happens commonly. They do that with Hulu suffers that a lot, but with something like um, subscription retention stays on more when you're watching like I don't know, Attack on Titan season four or whatever when that comes out on Crunchyroll because you have to stay subscribed to watch the season. So it makes sense. They want to keep their subscribers. That's why Disney Plus did that with the Mandalorian. Interesting. Ready? Yeah, this is something I had to learn in class. No, Dolphin Slash is not invulnerable in frame one. It's active on frame one. So a lot of people think it's actually, it's actually not even frame one anymore. It's like frame two or three. Go! Yeah, yeah, it's not. It's not, it's not yeah, it's not frame one invincibility, it's like frame two. Yeah, thank you, Kairos. Pretty sure it's frame two. It's not even invincibility, it's just really fast, so that a lot of people think it's invincible, but it's not. I'm surprised that uh, I'm seeing this stage, only because like when it's this version of the stage, I think it's kind of rough like, for I to get kills that aren't just like raw hits, because he doesn't get easy platform extensions. Oh, 
I'm sorry. Yeah, so Lucina's is up, is up B is frame two. It's frame five in the air. It's frame two on the ground. The hitbox starts frame two, but the animation starts frame one. Or if he gets the hitbox on frame three. Anyways, back to the game. Just, just, to, just to clarify there for y'all. Yeah, I, I don't know. I, I just know the up is really good. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's really hard to edge guard against them. Unless you're, they just really good at hitting you out your double. Being yeah. an edge guard, still haven't really seen a good one from Guts versus one uh, gaming. Even on the first set they played. Oh. I thought that would be much worse once he got put in a jab lock situation. Yeah. Guts is literally looking at the stock here, but getting gravity and finally with four dope. Guts is going for a few more uh, cross open airs, which I definitely recommend. Just because if you like get lazy and just drift into Luigi's shield unsafely with neutral air, it can backfire really heavily. Yeah, that was good in gaming. He went for his air in the air just because like, if I could try to approach with another aerial like that, he would have caught that close spot to be in. Yeah, this uh, this start might be really difficult for Guts. Again, going for like the force mastery just because he knows he doesn't want to take so much percent without you know taking the stock. Try to get an early kill as much as possible. I mean, yeah, I think Guts. That's what kind of Guts needs to do. Like you, you talk about reads right here. Like he definitely needs to read gaming on his movement and try to whip on it just a little bit more. This was something that he struggled even on the winners um, on the in the main side of the bracket, even though he was finally able to beat Guts, he wasn't able to do like empty hops or like, even if he can get same aerials, you know, the least he could do in situations like that is try to go for a tomahawk grab, but he wasn't able to even get some of those. And doing that against Luigi can be very beneficial in front of Okay, sneaks in that dash attack there. Let's see, let's see if uh, Guts has it in to make this comeback happen. It's not gonna be easy. Oh, man, he tried to start up his ether at the ledge. Um. Yeah. Unfortunately for Guts, yeah, he just went for a pretty risky option in that ether at the ledge, but uh, Gaming just kind of saw through that. Or at least he was just a little bit quicker with his crowd. So uh, I think, yeah, Guts again finds himself in a reverse 3-0 situation. Or I guess like the third time <laughs> today. Gaming though, one game away from getting its reset. I think both of these guys haven't won uh, MSU yet. So. It would be good for either of them if they were going up. Oh okay. no, God. He's fine, but that could have been much, much worse for him. I remember in the other games, if I ever does like a fastball in air, or even just a air in general off stage, he would just die because his air would take so long. <laughs> oh no. Campbell's in the chat. Yes. Definitely don't want to. Be SD in this situation. Oh my gosh. And the taunt. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Guts giving a free punish by charging that. Oh, smashing neutral. But, uh, it's all, I wouldn't even go as so far as say free punish. I would say like free, free bracket reset at this point. Yeah, I keep seeing uh, Guts go for that down air ledge, but it has not connected to any of the matches that's even played to it so far. Oh my goodness. Yeah, 
I think he could have tried to land a back air, but still better him for a neutral air. That was good. I like, see, this is what he needs to do. These empty hops. Look at how much gaming high buddy was safe to go for that one, and then he was able to execute with a dash pad. Ladies and gentlemen, b -b 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 bracket reset. Yeah, with the JV as well. Man, a lot more momentum coming from a uh, gaming than in the winner's side. Uh, I think Guts just needs a little bit more time to adjust to how gaming's playing now. Agreed, agreed. Maybe even like just getting warmed up a little bit too. Because it's been a bit since he played in comparison to gaming. See though, see what can change for Guts here in the reset. Pokemon Stadium 2. I feel like, oh no, he immediately went to Luigi's loving arms. Man, I was just, I was just gonna say, I feel like Guts is gonna camp the platforms again, like he did in the match that he won on this match. He should, he should. I don't see a reason for him not to. <sighs> Look, I know there's a lot of benefits to up B. But it's costing Guts too much that I think he really needs to change his neutral here. It's kind of like super armor based up there. Like the only thing that beats out super armor is a grab. Especially the tether grab. Yeah. In. Guts trying to find his opening here without overstating too much. Great parry up B. Good percent. And enough knockback to allow him to get stage control back. Okay. Again, he does not want to challenge Luigi too deep off stage. And there's another Cyclone. Unfortunately, look how that one might have shield poke. But, uh, yeah, kind of fortunate for Guts that uh, he's not really punching these cyclones as as hard as you probably should. Mm -hmm. Oh, that clank. Not in Gus's favor, but luckily- Oh! Uh, I thought he had enough space to come back to the ledge. Yeah, so did I. Gus missed it all. Finally we up there, he gets the stock. 2-1. Oh man. This is not looking good. That was good, that was good. He wanted to call out the Direction Rider dodge. Huh. It's the second time I've seen him drop that up B combo. Kind of surprising. Back air? Close. Back to the ledge here. Okay. First, gonna go for the fourth throw. Yeah, gaming is at this point, you can see the OBs and how uh, Gus is using them. He's just, he's waiting them out. Alright, sneaking in the back there. It's really hard for uh, Ike in this situation, I feel, because he can't really go for too many unsafe things to get his combo started. Yeah. But right there. Ooh. Not the best quick draw. His quick draws are actually getting caught a lot recently, too. There are times where he, like, times them on the ledge perfectly, but when he does it, he gets punished. Can you imagine, bro? That's how you die. Oh, yeah, not, not dead. Not dead in a, in a really bad spot. Just imagine, though. That's how you die. 
some some pool noodle throws you with his vacuum off the stage. Has a lot of fight in him yet. Okay, not dead, but man, they're getting these rogue of bees, dude. Oh, it's the ledge, but dang, still at 208%. Gaming's gotta be careful, though. You never want to just sleep on Rage Ike like this. Oh, most, most definitely not. Two hundred twenty-two percent. Yeah, I was gonna say like you could see that that guts was like leading on him for attack chase, or it was punish. <laughs> so gaming high was like really around there. Oh my god, seventy-seven. Yo, is guts about to steal this? Close, close, close. Kind of guess you said, but there's the cyclone. Oh my yeah. goodness, this guy, this guy. Throws out the cyclones like it's his job, man. But that was actually a, a good one too because if if Gus swung on him at all, it, it would just eat up his four air anyway. I think that's what he tried to go for. I have a feeling this is gonna be a case of guts running it back to Smashville. Or sorry, PS2. As much as he can. <laughs> yeah. It worked out really well before just because he was able to bait um gaming to approach modes on the platform using there. But, but I, don't know, I don't know if, yeah. yeah, I don't know if gaming's gonna fall for that twice. Gus is trying to sneak in these grabs just because he wants to see if he can bait gaming to like press a button when he's landing or air dodging, but it's not really getting that. Still alive to the upbeat. Guess it only kills most characters off the ledge. Yeah. Anti are up so a lot of people forget about that kill move from Mike. Yeah, gaming also, uh, if he recognizes he's in threat of getting a platform combo, if, if Gus is just a tiny bit off, he, he's just gonna hit that cyclone every time. Yeah. Again in a win box. Only up tilt is the win box, and it sucks you in. Only Ganon's up tilt is the win box. I don't agree with that forward air. Like, he should have gone for another nair or maybe another empty hop to see how gaming how was gonna approach with that one. Just a few little adjustments that he like guts needs to take this. Oh my goodness. I thought we were going to see another moment where Gaming High just charges a smash attack for like a minute and a half and dude is right into it. Okay, now he's using the armor to, to get past the up smash. So it hasn't gotten that down air to actually connect at the ledge. At this point, I would just, uh, I would just space for like a, a down tilt on neutral get up. Cause I think in, I think now in the new patch, uh, Ike's down tilt can combo to four Yeah. Nice. Nice, finally here. Okay, oh, okay, there you go. Good catch for sure. 
Okay. The moment you can make Luigi scared to like land a cyclone or neutral air is when you uh, have a really good chance of winning. <laughs> Please. Okay. Not gonna roll into the forest smasher. Still has a bit of work to do before he can take the stock. Nice. Great cross up there. Ooh. Enough? Nope. No, no, no. We all know how good it's lived with 200 and like 16% last time. So you definitely do it again. Uh, rough nair, rough nair, rough nair. Yeah, is this difficult right now for Guts? Because he's just fighting from a deficit a lot of times. Yeah. So, even if, like, he... Even if I had really good moves that just kept out Luigi, he, he wouldn't be able to abuse them because he's the one that's having to approach most of the time. It's just hard, too, because like, I feel like he's even going for a lot of safer approaches as well while he's behind, and he's still just getting punched. So again, uh, Guts position where he has to make the reverse 3 0 happen. Definitely hate to see someone get 6 0 in grands after winning versus the same person in winners. But uh, yeah, Guts gonna have to turn it up a little bit. And he's kind of doing it right now, barely missing that four smash. He definitely has a bit of a read on how Jamie wants to land, but he's just slightly outside of range for that game. Oh, we'll take it. Misfire into SD. He was low profile from the side B, so he couldn't even grab that. It's fine. Doing a great job of pulling onto this stock. Nice. Okay, caught the air dodge as well. Yeah, not the easiest of me to time that eruption on, but I respect the attempt. Yeah, I, I like what he's doing again, but uh, he doesn't jump off the platform. But yeah, I, if I was him, I would have just kept staying on that middle platform. Yeah. And just wait to see if. Uh, Gaming would overextend, then you can just get the, the narrow up there with like the platform extension as well. Yeah, Gunner Guts. Finally using a little bit more empty hopping, just trying to change things up in terms of timing and pace. Nice. Mm -hmm. Caught this man. Probably trying to set up for a landing of the leg with Tornado before you can do even execute it. Ooh. <sighs> that hurts. Yeah. I know he wants to see if he can get the uh, upbeat trade or like upbeat just like spike Luigi off stage, but he's barely missed the timing on that. Alright, nice. I like the up smash there again. Uh, Gaming's just been landing in a way that's very easy to uh, cover with smash attack at this point. Uh, both playing so patiently. Gus does not want to go out. 6-0. Gaming though. He knows he's so close to closing up this tournament. Yeah, he is. 
Yeah, he's not really giving a good, super easy punishes either. Okay, at the ledge again. Nice. Delaying the time on the narrator for the guts, making it pretty uh, ambiguous when he's gonna actually approach. Yeah, gaming's continuing to play patient as well, though. Ooh, no like, gaming, gaming has to win this for his sleep schedule, and I was like, bro, in college, there's no such thing as a sleep schedule. Ooh, still living, but he's at the ledge. How is the game gonna get off here? Nice. Just uses jumps and drift yeah. Now he's got a little bit more stage control. No. no. Oh. We're living, we're living, we're living. Ray Perry, but oh my goodness, Rogue is caught by the up smash. Really hanging on right thread here, Gus trying to make something happen, but Gamey is making it very, very difficult to get back to the center stage. Oh, this man is pressing every button on that controller. Dash tag still not enough. Oh, he missed up. <gasps> and it'll work. Oh man, Gabe did not expect him to be on stage like that. And Gus just saw the opportunity. Chased his lands, landing all the way down with that buff dash attack. Take it for sure, for sure. No 6-0 in grand finals. Guts, finally on the board. That was really scary. I think he could have died at almost any moment. All right, this is the first step in the reverse PO. In on the board. Let's see if Guts can uh, work off the momentum of making that big comeback happen. Oh, okay. Doesn't get the spike hitbox in the down there, so he's fine. Yeah, I think this is a, a great stage for Guts to, you know, win on if he's able to. He was able to beat Gaming on the stage before. Nice catch. Again, covering the landing really well, using that big dash attack. Really, really early stock player for Guts. Oh, here we go. Ooh. Interesting for uh, Gaming to go for. I thought he would go for the immediate, like, up B after he got the down. Oh. Oh, oh yeah. You inside of B knows, hey man, I got this stock up. I'll take it. Let me let me cash that into the bank, please. He's going for it again. <laughs> oh my goodness, watch out, man. Almost gets either spiked for the second time. Gus is playing the platforms. Nope. He keeps going for that dare nair cyclone, but it doesn't look like it's guaranteed. Ooh. The dash attack. Watch out. Nice. Positions himself away from the grab and turns it into a stock. Really good. For Gus, okay, I'm gonna count that as a three stock because the only stock he lost was to himself and he got the kill for it. Yeah. So almost perfect game there. Yeah, crazy. Guts is not only tearing things around, but he's bought on top of game five. It was originally literally like a 6 0. Yep. Gaming only had to win one more game. But now he's in the threat of uh, King Reverse 3 0 in the reset after winning five games in a row. Yeah, All right. Crazy. Let's see. Down to game five. Let's see what game's count is. He's going to run it back to Pokemon Stadium 2. The, the salty run back. Let's see if it uh, helps him out here. Right now, though, I can definitely see Guts playing with a lot of confidence going into this game five. 
Oh, nice again. He's definitely got a beat on how uh, gaming wants to land with these cyclones. He's been really successful in catching these charge smash attacks. Yeah, or even just dash attacks. Oh, that's huge. Only taking 6%. Man, gaming. I don't know. I don't know if gaming ran out of steam or what, but he looked really good to take this tournament. Now he's just all, all on the back foot. Yeah. Uh, that, I can't wait to see it too. Oh my goodness. Almost covering the entire platform with the up smash. Oh my goodness. Guts is swinging whatever movie he wants right now. Oh! 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 God. What happened? Guts is completely woken up. Only took 30%. Gaming has quite a hill, like, hill to climb right now. Oh my god. He's going for it all. He's going for it all. No, no, no. 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 That was too much. That was too much. That was way too much, guys. He too went, dude. He's like, I am trying to just destroy this man's career. I, I want this three stock. I want this reverse three oh. But uh, still, he still has a huge lead. Gaming still has to put in quite a bit of work to bring this back. Oh, Logan, not quite a bit of work isn't even that much, too, because you think about it, going like a combo away. And if Guts doesn't get safe aerials, like, he's just gonna get grabbed and comboed very heavily. Okay, oh, nice, nice, nice. That's some deck back. Struggling to get to the ground safely, but he's taking so much percent right now. Another mm -hmm. safe there. Oh, Nair in the back air is gonna get this edge guard going deep off stage. Gets no. the upbeat, but it's not worth it. Because he did not get the spike at all. Still got in a final stock situation. Yeah, now he's in a last stock situation after having a huge lead. I think he recognized, all right, man, I cannot get grabbed. Yeah, he knows. He knows. I, I not want to jump this one. Oh, okay, okay. Very bad air dog, but he went for a down smash instead of a ground, surprisingly. Oh, okay, you nice. go for the fourth throw? No, up throw. For the landing? Ooh, yes, 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 yes. Wow. He waited for the landing. He waited. He's like, this man will air dodge here. If he does not, he's still in a good position for a forward air. And he nice. caught it. Nice stuff. Nice stuff from Guts. Brought it all the way back after just losing five games in a row. Looked like he was completely out of it, but I don't know what happened, man. Like he just, he just started hitting everything. Everything's worked out. Yeah. But good stuff, good stuff to both players. Congrats to Guts for winning in 20 Good stuff though to Gaming for being second and getting the reset.